Boycotted. There are those candidates that are boycotting this talks that say, no, we should not restart the whole electoral process. This is a ploy for President Macky Sall to extend his time in office. What do you I have to say I don't agree about? with that. Because the president is very clear about what he said. In April 2nd, he's not, uh, his term ends in April 2nd. This is why he called the call. If you don't agree, as me, there's a lot of things I don't agree with, with the president. But I am always keen to sit down with him to express my concerns about the country that we collectively own, all of us. To me, to me, the other parts who passed, if they're fighting for democracy and they're fighting for the rule of law and justice, this is the place to do it, where the entire country is watching us, us political leaders in this country, to sit down in the table with people you don't agree with, in the confrontation of our ideas, then we can figure out what's the best in us for the betterment for the country, not only for an individual good or what's going to be better for me of my party, but we should all sit down together, even with those we don't agree with, to figure out to find a solution for the country. And, that, and I applaud the president, actually, for, for making that call and making the stand to make it clear that after April 2nd, he is not a president anymore, but it's on us now together to fix the date together, but also to fix what's going to happen if we, don't, if we cannot uh, make the elections happen this year. To April 2nd, what are we going to do next? All those things come to discussion. Of course, this is going to be the month of Ramadan, organizing elections in just 30 days' time. I don't believe it's possible. It's to not do it possible, in a month or right? Two. But what do you expect from these talks? President Macky I Sarkis expect said solutions. Even the end, the World War II, World War I, all of the wars around the world, what happened in the United States and Japan, all those things happen in talks afterwards. It's in talks that we find solutions, especially with the people you don't disagree with. And in this country, we got to go back in our basics. We are built in consensus. In our ancestors here, ancestors, our elders, they always talked. They always went through the tree to talk about the issues in the village. And in Wolof, we say, we go back where we come from to figure out how we can fix this problem. Because this country is not for us. It was given to us by the next generations to hold. And we have a responsibility, a core responsibility, a fierce urgency now is to make sure we leave it in a good hand. And we don't let our division, our political divisions, burn this country up. We, it's our, this is why I'm here. Even though I don't agree in many of these things, but I'm here to confront my ideas with such of the president and his party. Chun Young, thank you very much for this. Thank you very much.